Can you see that big boy in the background? He is really at it. He wants to get that tree out of the way. Hey, big boy. Yes, thank you for moving. It's perfect. They like fish, you know, with the fish, for them they have no tongue. With the fish again, they've got the soft skin, so it is very easy. On this episode of Across All Borders Going East, join me for a Nile on the Nile. Boat cruise through Mochison Falls National Park, Uganda. For my second stop on day one of my road trip through Uganda, we made a stop at Mochison Falls National Park. Let's talk a bit about the park. It sits on the shore of Lake Albert in northwest Uganda. It's known for Mochison Falls, where the Nile River surges through a narrow gap over a massive drop. The park wildlife includes 76 mammals such as elephants, hippos, um, there are also chimpanzees, but also over 450 bed species that you can experience. The Lake Albert Delta is home to the rare shoebill stock, amongst other birds. What can you do in the park? To explore the park, you can visit the top of the fall. You can either do that by hiking up or driving to the area where you walk to the different viewing points. And then you can also explore the, the park area by doing a boat cruise on the River Nile. This is a three-hour boat cruise that allows you to experience the different animals and wildlife that you will see on the banks of the River Nile. Crocodiles, hippos, elephants, bird life. Otherwise, you can do a regular game drive in the Biluji game area. From the side we came, so coming over from Kampala, we needed to cross the bridge. As of the time we were there, it was not open. So getting to the game area would have meant a four-hour drive around to go there. So I skipped that part of it. So guys, this is the departure port for the boat cruise at Mochison's Hall. We really had to rush, uh, but David was good and we made it and they waited for us. So fortunately, they say the tracks for hiking are not open so we're not going to be able to do that but he'll take me to the falls the top of the falls later so Hello. i'll do that as well i've chosen to call it the nile on the nile because i drank the nile special while cruising down the nile join me as we explore also is a part of a typically we normally do because we don't just move straight, straight away we keep just making fun with the hippos the crocodile Again, besides all that, also may come across, if you're lucky enough, maybe to see the elephants come to drink water, the buffalo, and some of the antelope. And I can see you guys, you have got a camera, either the phone camera, so it is now the time now. So what come across, please let them also enjoy a peek. So a time when you're resting, so it is now your time just to be doing the selection. The good one remain, the bad one you delete. <laughs> And also I think um, we are using one language, the one sharing us together. Mm -hmm. We have got a different accent. So in case maybe when I'm trying to, uh, to explain something, when you're not picking it right, keep asking. The time when you're going and coming back, I need everyone just to be saying, oh, that little boy is a good guy. <laughs> and also on board, we have got the safety equipment, the life jacket. And also nine o'clock. So that is the one we call the Golas Heron. Golas heron, either you can call it the Goliath heron, is the is the biggest among the six species of heron mm. we have in the whole world. And again, in flight, if they can stretch even that wing, that wingspan up to 152 centimeters. Do they eat fish? They do. Okay. They eat fish. And breeding time for crocodile also, they can also take the younger one for crocodiles, as well as snakes, followed by the one found in Australian, the salt lake water crocodile. 
and the full grown ones can grow, can grow up to six meters and again they can weigh up to 1,000 kilogram which is one ton why is it uh, it is out Did of you the get land? Let me see. was it when it was out of the water and the good thing with them that body has got a spring glands whether they dive in the in the water even for more than a hundred times their body cannot get typically wet like other birds the pied kingfisher so why do they make the leather eggs inside there and also another thing on both have have got my small cooler box in front there in the cooler box there's some of the water soda and beer it's and cold then, is it cold yeah okay and again for your first time for your first time just to enjoy a beautiful cruise on the night which happened just to be uh, to be the longest river in the whole world cover total distance of 6,695 kilometers and after taking a night on the night what do you think will happen you become special that's okay. why we are holding the night special but okay. one of them goes at the coast and also i love the question in case maybe you want just to know something feel free just yeah. to ask me I'm a guide, stroke a captain, so in case when I say there's something 12 o'clock, look straight where the boat is pointing. Okay. 1 o'clock, 11 o'clock, so that just to make it easier for us. Mm. I'll just look where they are looking. <laughs> <laughs> as long and, as we uh, look at the right place. Yeah, the, the <laughs> condition. <laughs> and uh, lastly, I can say, uh, thank you guys. Say, oh, wow, Bosco, look at the snake in the water. Uh, when is the bird, yeah? And also the bird will not bring glands. When they stay for long in the water, also their body also gets typically wet. When they are typically wet, they don't make a proper fly. And after coming out from the water, sometimes you get to see them on the ground, either on the branch of a on the branch of the tree while the wind. In terms of the bird life, what kind of birds can you expect to see? You can expect to see a rare shoe bill stock and other popular species include the Goliath heron, which you will see, the African quail fitch, the elegant grey crowned cranes, blue headed caucal, white browed sparrow weaver, swamp fly catcher, red truited bee eater, African jacanda, silver bird, different types of kingfishers, and lots of other birds. Oh wow, look at it quite. Yeah, there you go. There you go. I think they're coming to us. I know. You, you don't think so? <laughs> See, they're all coming out. Oh, it's time for food. They're like, okay. Yeah. that water is forming some white circles it is actually the force of the water we're not able to get close to the fall because even though you can't see them there are areas here where there are logs and there are areas here where you have um, rocks so we can't really typically get in close except we have a fishing license which we don't but we're still going to get in as close as we can and give you the best shot so do enjoy if you come down to Uganda or Murchison's waterfall you do the cruise and get the best of it because we've seen a lot of hippos crocs and all sorts of birds so it is water um, and make sure you bring your insect spray because they are set supplies all over here and they're not very nice so that's it for me to you Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to do the hike today to the water head because the boat's not stopping where we get up, but I'm going to go around with a car to see it. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. You can see the force of the water. Ah, and there are so many sets of flies here. 
Wow. Ja, genau, das wollte ich sagen. Also er hat sich markiert. Wow. And we have to 6000 kilogram which is 6000. Wow. Even you can ask yourself why is it all the time the elephant the light just flapping the ears. It's cooling down, isn't it's it? Cooling down exactly. And also the good swimmer It's if a good like swimmer? Plan, yes, if oh. they plan even to cross the river from this side to that side, they can? also they can make it. Ooh. And I've got a lifespan of uh, 70 to 85 years. In captivity, they can reach up to uh, 100 years. Wow. Yeah. He is huge and he is checking us out like big time. He's like, who are these intruders? I give you five seconds to get out of my territory. He charged at your car, but did he attack it? No, but he was like, you know, he was doing like this, so he's oh, trying wow. to intimidate you. Yeah. That was so scary. <laughs> oh my God, this boy is big. Look at him breaking. Look at him at what, guys? He is breaking that tree. He wants to get a good look at us. He's like, I need to see this intruders. Come on, boy. Wow. Guys, that is where we left from and that's the office of the Will Frontiers. This is the bridge that should be able to allow you cross to the other side, but it's not completed yet. That is the lower one that you can take, but because of the tide, that how high it is, you're not allowed to take it at this time. So you can cross by boat, meaning you have to get um, a ranger on the other side to do the game drive with you, or it's a four hour circle to actually be able to do the game drive if you came from Kampala, which is then uh, to Daunton. So I'm skipping the game drive in Mochison's, but it's been awesome because we saw a huge elephant and um, some other hippos, loads of hippos, bird life. So it was worth it. And we saw Mochison's fall. And I'm going to see the head of the fall in a few minutes and then we're done for today. Walking on this trail is paid for $15. Which trail are they talking about? So it's going down that way? Okay. So we're going this way and okay uh -huh. ah <laughs> bonyoro mm. okay guys we are in the bonyoro kingdom so of course in commemoration of the visit of his majesty solomon bafa abusa iguru one uh, the Bonyoro Kitara Kingdom, the Oko Omokama of the Bonyoro Kamara Kingdom, they erected this. And here is showing 50 years of the park. 
It closed for a period of time. Uh, from when? Till 2002. To the viewpoint of the Murchison waterfall. We saw it on the Nile. Now we're going from the upper part. I could have hiked up here, but the trail is not open at the moment. So you can drive around. It's 12 kilometers. And then you get to the upper part of the Nile and you can, uh, not the Nile, the Murchison's waterfall and it says be careful slippery rocks they're actually quite shiny which is very interesting why do they have like this shiny look? Ah, okay Oh my god, I can see it. This is crazy. Oh wow. Oh wow. The name is boiling. Oh yes. Yes, yes, yes. I'm keeping you guys in suspense, but just for a few seconds and then you can witness this magnificent sight with me. we're continuing because the view continues and those things that look like tents in the back they're processive lies look at that that is processive lie Ooh, and they're very aggressive huh you know i've had my experience with them <sighs> in tanzania so your girl is tired i'm tired of processive lies <sighs> let's go So guys, it is the end of the one. We are going to go to the lodge. And that's that baby that we are going with. That is the rough for the three doors uh, from road trip. It's been good, but we've had to refuel already because we're covering quite a bit of a distance. And so today we were like kind of also rushing to make sure we met the timeline. So now we go. <laughs> We go. <laughs> we go, we go, we go, we go, we go, let me show you this. I do hope you've enjoyed this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Yours truly, Liesl81.